Okay, this is where we were at the beginning. So, did we make it? Did we save her? Did we figure out who the guy in the house was? Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Sally Green and I am playing a really cool game on Roblox. It's called Absent. It's a single player game and it says, it's a single player game. It's a strange adventure. You're sent to Antarctica to rescue some survivors in a helicopter, but the path your helicopter, but in the path your helicopter crash, you wake up with amnesia and meet a girl who will help you. After that, you start searching for them. Okay, so this is in first person and I can't scroll out of first person and apparently this was our helicopter crash. Okay, so W, press the walk key. Okay, so it's not, dub it is WASD, but it's not. W is opening this menu, S just walks forward and A and D moves any leg. Okay, that's different too. All right, we're just gonna walk forward, S. I have to press A and D. I have to press A and D. Okay. That's so weird. <laughs> so I have to like alternate A and D. She says, I said, who are you? Where are we? You survived the crash. Maybe you're a bit confused. Uh, uh, the pilot died. I I'm afraid we'll have to walk for the rescue. We're the rescue team of those who had a similar accident. Well, we should search for them. Maybe they're close to us. Okay, let's go. All right, so W and or A and D, like A D A D A D A D A D, and the the more I move them, the faster I go. <gasps> I think I see something. She says, "Uh, what the bleep is that thing?" <laughs> no bad words. Do not say that word here. Yeah, don't say that word here. <laughs> Why? I don't understand. <gasps> I'm glad I have the sound on. Look at her face. <gasps> what? Did you just see that? I saw it. Follow me. Uh-oh. Why am I gonna follow you there? Do you know where you're going? I, I don't know where I'm going. You seem to know where you're going. Um, can I jump? Okay, I can jump. Really? What was that? <gasps> I would answer you if I knew. Well, apparently you seem to know something because I'm following you here. <gasps> you don't remember our helicopter crashed. You're wrong. It didn't crash. It just fell and collided on the floor. Shouldn't... Antarctica be frozen? Yes, Antarctica itself is freezing. When they warned us that they were lost, they said that it was cold. <gasps> that looks like an astronaut. You don't remember? What if I told you you're not in Antarctica? I would say that you're wrong. It's impossible that this is not Antarctica. I guess the purple is her chat and the blue is mine. But what does an astronaut do here? I wonder the same. We must continue searching. I might have to turn the in-game sound down. Astronaut. Wait, this is weird. We were just in a helicopter. And Antarctica should be frozen. Okay. Go faster. Catch up with her. Jump over the rocks. I like the music and I hope it's not copyrighted because I'm definitely keeping it in. Uh-oh. Hold on. Let me turn down the sound a little bit. Okay, I don't think it's too loud. Oh, to just to check, make sure that wasn't too loud for you guys. Okay, let's go this way. Go, 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 go. It's hard to see the landscape. All right, keep going. <gasps> it looks like a structure. Doesn't it look like a structure on the right-hand side? This is very mysterious. There's this person. I said, it's really cold here. She says, you see? I said, I'm afraid not. This place is very lonely, so quiet. <gasps> what is this place? Okay, if there's a jump scare that's too scary, I promise I'll edit it. Right now it's just really weird. <laughs> and there's that TV with the fuzz that is really crazy. <gasps> what is going on? Okay, that TV needs to turn off. <laughs> it's just crazy. Come on, turn it off. Can we get up? Can I move around? Okay. I can. Alright, good. There's a scream. There's a radio music. Okay, I'm in a house suddenly. What if we go upstairs? I don't know. Every scary movie you shouldn't go upstairs, but it looks like she's upstairs. So let's see what's up here. 
She's in this room. Can we go in here? <gasps> what? What was that? That is so weird. But there's crates and boxes and... What is this place? This is so strange. <gasps> the music is cool. All right, so... What? There, is this a dream? I bet this is the dream. Follow me, something fell over there, she says. It's happening again. Uh-oh, what's happening? Come on. <gasps> oh, come on, up this ridge. Can I get up here? Wait, which way am I going? She's up there, but where am I... Where am I trying to go? <laughs> is there anything else to investigate? Oh, it's a TV. What is this? So weird. Okay, can I get up here with her? Yes. Okay. There must be survivors over there. Okay, we're survivors too. But I don't know if we're very much help to everybody. How long have we been here? I asked her. I don't know. I don't know either. <gasps> okay. Um, what is that thing in the sky? It's so weird. <laughs> Alright. I don't know. We gotta solve this mystery. This is such a strange game. There's something over there to the left. And there's stuff to the right. And is that a mountain ridge or is that a structure? And we're gonna be able to get up there. Look, she said. Why'd you, oh, it looked like she sat down. Yes, the helicopter has disappeared. I guess the helicopter was over here. But why? She said, I can't answer that question. What if I told you we are dead? No, that's impossible. <gasps> That doesn't explain why a helicopter along with its pilot has disappeared. Wait. Silence. I hear something. It came from there. Well, yeah, I think there's something there. Go, 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 go. Oh, no. It's getting very dramatic. That looks like a helicopter. Or a bomb. <gasps> I see a house over there. I haven't seen it before. Then we are not alone on this place, obviously. It's probably uninhabited, she said. You're right. Nobody will be there. We're alone. Why does it look like there's bombs on the landscape? That's kind of creepy. <gasps> Are we, like, in a war zone or something? All right, let's see what's in this house. I wonder if it's the house we just saw in our dream or whatever that sequence was. Run fast. Run fast. Maybe she's not who she... Maybe she's not nice. Maybe she's not as friendly as we think she is. Ooh, that could possibly be it. <gasps> take a flashlight. How do I take a flashlight? And look! There's someone. I know, they're dead. Or asleep, or something. Hello, wake up, sir! Wake up! Wake up! Um, how do I take a flashlight? Oh, I think it's over there beside her. Weird. Who are you? <gasps> We're the rescue team, but our helicopter crashed. Oh, bad word. <laughs> Darn it. <gasps> Where are the others? I would like to know. I hope they are fine. Do you have a radio to ask for another rescue group? Do you think we have not tried that, he says. The sky and everything turned purple. Some just disappeared. What are you doing here? You're alone, I asked. He said, I await my death. I've been here for three days. I don't know anything about the others. This place, this place is bad. This is not Antarctica? It is. Maybe someone is on the cave east of here. We took refuge there before he arrived. I know where it is. It's close, she says. Oh, okay. We're just running out. <gasps> is that a door? <laughs> Let me out. <gasps> Which way is the door? We go this way? Wait, it looks like she just jumped out the window. Can I just jump out the window? <laughs> no. <laughs> the door's over here. Okay. Well, she's way far away. All right, well, am I following her? I think I am supposed to follow her. I've been following her this whole time. Oh, man. Okay, so there's a guy in this shack. And she says, this is the place. And I said, how did you know? She said, I just know. Let's go inside. Oh, okay, there's my flashlight. All right, good, I've been needing a flashlight. I guess she's in here. 
Ooh, that's kind of creepy. There's bricks in here like there was a... Oh, it's like a bunker. <gasps> that was easy to open the door, I know. But what is this? Energy bank, stored energy. A laboratory. It's closed, she says. There might be another way in. <gasps> oh, it's very hot here. <gasps> I'm, I, I'm starting to feel dizzy. Uh oh. That's generally not a good thing. <gasps> What's wrong? The nuclear reactor is activated. Uh oh, it's only emitting radiation and it's going to explode. We got it this way. There's no time. Go to the emergency exit and leave. Okay, gladly. Can I get out of here? Can I go? Out this way? Now escape. Follow the exit sign. Oh. Over this way. Over this way. Ah! Okay. Go, 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 go. Run fast. <laughs> That's scary, scary stuff. <sighs> go, go, go. Emergency exit. Emergency exit. Oh. Ah! Well... We must rescue five people. They are in Antarctica. We will go on our helicopter with a space of seven people. We have to explore the area a little until we find them. What? According to them, it's very cold and we will bring the necessary resources. What happened? So are you ready? This seems like we're on the helicopter at the beginning. I am. Only two of us will go to the place? Yes. There would be no space for anyone else. Was that a dream? What is this? <gasps> I couldn't save ourselves. Who are you? You were not with us in the helicopter. Neither a hiker to whom we should save. Who the heck are you? <gasps> I don't need to tell you, she says. I'm like you. We're lost. Can you move? This will explode in two hours. Two hours? I can't, I said. I can take you outside and you could save yourself. I can only move a few meters and we would go slow. I would have to go back to continue shutting down the reactor. But if I could leave, leave you here and I would save myself. I know it's a hard decision. Or we both die and one of us is saved. I'm so confused. Um, she is saved. D, you must live. It's okay, don't worry, she said. Wait, really? Don't you want to live? No, I can't move. Well, thanks, but you're forgetting something. If you can walk and get out of here, my existence does not allow it. <gasps> Wait. Now I'm back at the wreckage. Is that what happened? I'm so confused. I'm trying to figure this out. <laughs> Okay, this is where we were at the beginning. So, did we make it? Did we save her? Did we figure out who the guy in the house was? Did we save the other people we came in the helicopter to save? Are any of these questions going to be answered? Okay, this is how it started. Right? We walk up this way. And this is exactly how it began. <gasps> Who are you? Where are we? I survived the fall. Maybe I'm confused. The pilot is dead. Where'd she go? Oh, there she is. Way far away. I'm afraid we'll have to wait for the rescue. We are the rescue team of those who had a similar accident. I need to search for them. Maybe they're close. Let's look for them together. Is this where I'm supposed to be? <gasps> where are you? Answer me if you're over there. What the heck is that thing? Uh oh. <gasps> what is going on? Was this a lab experiment the whole time, I wonder? I bet it probably was. I bet it's all been part of some kind of like dream. Help me, please. All this is going to explode very soon. The reactor sounds again. Where are you? How much time has passed? Oh my gosh. What's wrong? The nuclear reactor is activated. It's not only emitting radiation, it's going to explode. There's no time. I must get to the emergency exit. Yes, I know. But I must also stay here. 
No escape, I must follow the exit sign. This is going to explode. The time stopped. I realized that she never existed. It was just a product of my sick mind. The universe divided. In the first one, you were dead. While in the second universe, you were alive. Most surprising of all is that there would be a third universe where the two possibilities would coexist. In the end, it turns out that you were, you were not or did not exist in a certain place. Absent. That's it? <laughs> wow. <laughs> that is crazy. Let me turn off this music. <laughs> that is insane. All right, guys. Well... That was really weird. Um, I had to make a few edits because there were some um, not totally G-rated words. So if you do choose to play this game, just understand that in the dialogue, um, there's a light cuss word. And um, I have edited in the video, um, but just be aware that if you choose to play this game, that that word is in there. And anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I love playing Roblox games that don't look or sound or feel or have anything to do with Roblox at all. <laughs> So this was definitely interesting if you like story games and if you want to give it a try the link will be in the description But like I said, just please be aware that there is a light curse word. It's not totally G, G rated um, I've edited it in the video. Anyway, we'll see you guys again next time. Thank you so much for watching. Bye